<laughs> if you can track him. All right, that. And he's gone. <laughs> and he's gone. There's one over here. Oh, yeah. There he is. <laughs> we have a million right now. We do. You can tell every time you're in the barn in the daytime. In the daytime, they curse at you <laughs> endlessly while you're working in there. And then the one time I come out to film them because we're finally <laughs> to a point where I can do this at night. It's cool enough. It's pleasant enough. There's our lovely moon for tonight. Half moon. Yep. A little more than half moon. Somebody cut it right down the middle. All right, Ginger. We're going to bed. Good night, lemur. There's one. <laughs> if I can track him. Oh, you goofy bats, you. Theoretically, if I hold the camera still long enough, <laughs> you would think one would cross. Because they're right, we have a bunch right now. And you're welcome to all the mosquitoes you can eat. Like the one that keeps trying to bother me while I'm doing this. Well, if I got any on film, it's probably just through stupid, sheer, blind, dumb luck. You guys are chatty today. How are you doing there, bats? Why, look at you way up there. That dark cluster right there. I think that is they. Oh, all huddled up in a heap. Let's see, right there. Yep. You would think by now. They'd be used to me coming and going. Oh, they are really talking today. Oh yeah, that is definitely the bat. I can see one crawling there. I don't know that the phone is picking it up. Oh, there, there you go. Yeah, that's one of you. Can't really tell how many there are in that cluster, but there's a decent number. And they are probably ticked at me because I had to come in here to take care of some things, but that's the way it works. And they're not gonna like it because I have to slide open the doors. Not that it's going to interfere with them physically as far as their perch. The door is over here and slides on the rail track. But they won't like the noise. They won't like the vibrations. And they're gonna cuss at me big time. But I need to do it to get our trash receptacle out there because we store the trash over here. So sorry guys, I apologize in advance. I need to come out here later tonight when they start getting active. Maybe I'll be able to catch them while they're flying around. Like I did the other day. Yes. Yes. Okay, so we've got ourselves a downed bat. We can hear him. We are trying to get him. Where is he? Where is he? He sounds super close. Oh, Kentucky Rose, you're in the way. Yeah. Darn Kentucky Rose. Oh, he's right here. He's right here. He's mad because it's shining. Oh, yes, he is. Okay. 
He tried to bite me, so I'm going to use the stick that I did in the barn. Oh, he's trying to get in the crevice there. That was a rock that was not scary. He's trying to hide. I have, where is he? He is underneath this thing here. So. Oh, there he is. Hold on. I know, but the stick is you your friend. Back. The stick is your friend. You just don't know it yet. Come here. Yeah. Yeah, we're going to get you up. Oh, this is awesome. There we go. Oh, aren't you a cutie? Excuse me. Aren't you so cute? No. The problem I had was I was trying to get him up there. He had a hold of the tree. He had a hold of the branch. But he let go of the tree. And then he fell. Okay, so here's what I suggest. You want a safety net? I've got my insect net. I can always, I hardly use it for insects, so I might as well use it for bats. Don't you think if I put him up as high as I can reach in the tree, he should be able to fly? Well, you would think theoretic, theor, theor, yeah, you would think. <laughs> uh, it's late. If he, he will let, let he likes the stick, but yeah, that, that is the problem. Well, we may have to put him in the barn. Probably would also help if I got the light out of his face, honestly. That's probably so. upsetting him. Hmm? That's probably upsetting him. In the barn, he'll have familiarity. Yeah. He will. And, and, and maybe that's part of it. Perhaps you can help him out. He'd fall in into the bottom of the barn. Sorry, Minnie. Oh, that's not a good Excuse place me. with the horses. He was, he was up on the wall, but he was only up on the wall a couple of in inches. So he'd obviously fallen all the way to the bottom. That risky. He's on fire. Well, I gotta say, there are still a few up there in the uh, rafters, up there, and flying around, too. Usually so. I have them in my hand, and it's easier to tell when they've gotten a hold of something. Right. Well, Unfortunately, even though oh, Rabies is kind right of... Off. He says it's dark. Yeah, it's he's dark got a shadow there. there. Rabies is rare in the bat there. population in Indiana. Last I knew, but it is not it an is impossibility. Still. And it He's would crawling be... further on the stick. Yeah, what are you doing on the stick? Oh, you're so cute. There we go. One. So, Crawl off. little brown bat. Or is he a big brown bat? He's probably a young big, because every time we bring one in, they're identified as big brown bats. You want me yeah, to bring it up here? I can still see him. Oh, he's crawling yeah. up. Oh, he's good. Get a picture of him crawling. You are being so obliging. I can't see him here. Now. I'm up slightly higher now. Yeah, he's slowly making his way. There he is. His wing, anyway. There he is. Oh, look at you. Oh, you're cute. I saw one of his family swooping. Yeah. Yeah, he's working his way up to the top of the beam there. So... He's in good, good position. Okay, Ken, I'm closing the door. Okay, I'm getting ready to wrap this up now, so. But anyway. Oh, look, there he is. He's just so cute. Oh, you clever little fellow. All right, well, I'll tell you what. Your mom might be in here looking for you. Or the rest of the colony, anyway, might. So, I tell you what, we are going to wrap this up here. Since you're out of the way, probably will come out up on top. If that hole goes all the way through, and it looks like here it might, it might take him to the top beam there, where he can keep going up until he gets to the rafters, because that's where the colony nests. Biggest bat house ever. Okay, there's probably barns bigger than this, but
right, guys. Have a good evening. Good hunting to you. Eat lots of mosquitoes.